an unmanned rocket has blasted off from NASA's Wallops Flight Facility in Virginia in the U.S., with a robotic explorer on a mission to investigate the moon dust and atmosphere. Called the Lunar Atmosphere and Dust Environment Explorer, or LADY, the moon orbiting craft will measure the thin lunar atmosphere. Scientists want to learn the composition of the moon's ever so delicate atmosphere and how it might change over time and whether dust actually levitates from the lunar surface. Unlike the quick three-day Apollo flights to the moon, the Lady will take a full month to get there. The six-month mission costs $280 million. It will orbit Earth's closest neighbor for a few months, analyzing the ever-so-delicate atmosphere and lunar dust. An Air Force Minotaur rocket, built by Orbital Sciences Corporation, is providing the ride. This will be the first moonshot from Virginia. All but one of NASA's approximately 40 moon missions, including the manned Apollo flights of the late 1960s and early 1970s, originated from Cape Canaveral, Florida. The most recent were the Twin Grail spacecraft launched two years ago. The lone exception, Clementine, a military NASA venture, rocketed away from Southern California in 1994. The soaring miniature rocket should be visible along much of the East Coast as far south as South Carolina as far north as Maine and as far west as Pittsburgh. The mission will last six months and end with a suicide plunge into the moon for Lady, which is about the size of a small car.